it's so it's so empty i i was not expecting this let us wear masks at all times and avoid all unnecessary contact stay safe and healthy Day 150 in quarantine. Yes, you heard it right. It's oh my god, it's crazy. It's 150 days, um, and today is actually the first day that is not as gloomy. You can even see a little bit of blue sky over there. And I'm currently out to get some provisions um, just because I need something very spontaneously. And this is the first time during ECQ that we're going grocery shopping. And to be very honest with you guys, I'm already a little bit afraid of it because our friends George and Lucy told us a few stories, um, which I'm not looking forward to. Apparently they had to wait two hours to go grocery shopping. So we'll see. the second entrance is closed so I'm going to go around the corner keep fingers crossed that there aren't many people so we are only allowed to go out one by one uh, meaning that Mike had to stay at home we only have one quarantine pass so it's my turn today and very little traffic very few people so as you can see There's not much going on and it seems like there aren't that many people at Rustin's right now so maybe I'm lucky. First impression it seems like it's very quiet today. I have no idea why but it's fairly empty for rust and standards <laughs> but that means it's good for me so I can take my time Yee. there's this new brand at Rustin's it's called no brand seems like they have a, some kind of slickers thing here mm. guys Mike sent me specifically to get these and something else that we've been missing is this and you have to be very very careful when you buy these because once you open them they're gone within five minutes we also need some food for peanut and we need some dishwashing detergent as you guys know we have a dishwasher and ooh, <laughs> it takes care of the dishes every day. So we're very lucky to have it. Let us wear masks at all times and avoid all unnecessary contact. Stay safe and healthy. Thank you. Okay, this is the first time that I heard this announcement. Um, I don't know if you have it where you live, but everybody is keeping their distance, everybody is wearing the mask. It's looking good. Okay, as I'm walking through Rustin's, it seems like everything is stopped. Um, there's nothing missing, and I mean, look at it. It's so it's so empty i i was not expecting this just because our friends told us different stories uh when ecq was in place so i feel a little bit relieved that i can go shopping without uh, you know having to wait for too long or being afraid that there will be a shortage in um, food 
But yeah, I'm done. Very little pe people here. <laughs> I'm good. I'm done with the shopping. Uh, the advantage of me going shopping is that I can go outside for a little bit. The disadvantage, the disadvantage is I have to carry all the heavy groceries. So I think we're going to stick to ordering it online as much as we can. But in today's case, I just wanted to get out of the house for a little bit. I just uh, uh, needed some some uh, change of scenery, I would say. <laughs> but yeah, as you can see, there is nobody outside. And this is something that I have to point out. People are sticking to the rules here, which is really, really good. Everybody was wearing masks. Everybody was social distancing. And to be very, very honest with you guys, I was a little bit afraid, as I said in the beginning, to go grocery shopping because I, I thought it's going to be super packed uh, and I will stand in line for forever. And then, uh, yeah, I don't know. But it's all good. It's all, uh, it all worked out. I, I really wasn't expecting this. This is really a surprise. And wow, <laughs> uh, I hope it stays this way. But now I'm going to head home, make some dinner for tonight and uh, make sure this vlog is edited and all is sorted. Let me know in the comments down below if anybody hates it as much as I do when an escalator is not working. <laughs> it's just so weird. So, so weird. Oh, oh it's so heavy. Wow. It's love at second sight If we wanna make it right You've got me giving up control It's so weird when there's very little traffic It almost seems like we're not in Manila <laughs> Wow Alright guys, I arrived at home and I hope you enjoyed this super exciting not exciting <laughs> uh, grocery shopping tour I thought it's worth sharing because um, I painted it completely different in my mind. I know that a lot of things went slightly back to normal. This, this is the new normal. Um, yeah, but I was uh, still shocked to see that uh, the supermarket was actually still like pretty empty. But yeah, I thought it's worth sharing with you guys in case you had the same thoughts as I did. And um, I also saw that we have a lot of new subscribers. I just wanted to say we have different vlogs here on the channel. Um, we have lots of travel content as well. Um, more fun activities, more fun than grocery shopping or uh, quarantine vlogs. But um, if you want to check them out, um, check out the playlists that we have on our channel and just uh, scroll through our videos and see what you would like to see from the Philippines. Um, and for those of you who are still stuck sticking with us, despite the monotone uh, or like the, the limited activities that we have and are still in quarantine, thank you so much for sticking with us. It means a lot to us. Um, I received a message on Instagram the other day saying um, that people still appreciate the content because they can relate so much and that makes me happy because I, when, when I'm on Instagram and I see people from other countries already traveling, I kind of feel a little bit sad that we can't travel right now and that we're still in quarantine. It's 150 days and I don't think that there will be a lot of change. Um, I was following the news and I think the president waits for the vaccination um, until they want to open up everything. So it can still take a while. Um, but yeah, uh, we're staying positive and we're trying to make the best out of it. And we really, really appreciate that you guys tune in with us almost on a, sing it's, uh, almost on a daily basis. So thank you, thank you, thank you so much for that. Oh, wait, one more thing, one more thing. Um, if you aren't following us on Instagram, Mike made it a mission to uh, sing and perform a, a Filipino song on the guitar when he reaches 100k on Instagram. And I will sing if I reach 100k on Instagram by 
end of August. So um, we will show you a lot of uh, behind the scenes from the Philippines, from our life here in the Philippines uh, on our Instagrams as well. Trying to uh, show a little bit of peanut if you want to see our cat. So make sure to head over there and give us a follow and also feel free to shoot us a message if you have questions if you just want to connect with us if you just want to um, share your experiences uh, in quarantine just feel free to message us anytime okay that was it we'll see you guys tomorrow same time same place remember to stay awesome be positive and whoa make it happen